Over the past few years, the Trimble Tomcats have been perennial state contenders, and one fan has been along for the ride every step of the way. Kaylin Hill, granddaughter of boys head coach Howie Caldwell, went to school at Eastern, yet attended as many Trimble games as possible. She would show up at games and refs would give her the game ball and she'd sit over there. And I think she really loved basketball. She suffered from nemaline myopathy, a rare condition that afflicted her skeletal muscles, confining her to a wheelchair since she was just two years old. Despite her condition, she left many inspired about how she approached her life. You took each day and cherished it. Uh, I never saw when it looked like she was having a bad day. Each milestone achieved by the Tomcats was cherished by Hill, as she had always loved when they cut down the nets. In fact, in her home, she would have each net that she had won. Uh, like I told the players after the game, uh, when we won that particular year, it would be on her pillow beside her. This past August, Kaylin passed away, leaving a hole in the town of Gloucester. Still, the community found ways to honor her. There's a sign in the gymnasium that says the best seat in the house and loving, and loving memory of Kaylin Hill. And she would always sit there. and Just little things like that being incorporated into the community is just kind of showing how much she impacted everybody. The players rallied together as well to keep Hill with them. When we were getting our shoes, Blake Guffey came into the locker room with a Sharpie. And we put four Kalen on everybody's shoe. Coaches, players, and fans alike will all keep Kalen in their hearts long after she's gone. She was an inspiration to everybody that came in touch with her. Her legacy will live on.